Uh, the report out of CNN and BuzzFeed claiming Russia uh, collected compromising personal data and financial information about the president-elect. Mr. Trump took strong exception to that at his press conference. Again, here's the president-elect. I will say again, I think it's a disgrace that information would be let out. Uh, I saw the information, I read the information outside of that meeting. Uh, it's all fake news. It's phony stuff. It didn't happen. And it was gotten by opponents of ours, as you know, because you reported it and so did many of the other people. Uh, you know, Rand, when you're a Republican in Washington, D.C., you're not used to getting exactly fair treatment from, from a lot of the press. Has Mr. Trump redefined what happened here and, and your reaction to his comments today at his press conference? I think the number one thing we should be examining and trying to discover is who in the Intelligence Committee or who in the Obama White House leaked this type of information. Number one, if you are a public figure and someone tries to blackmail you, your immediate response and the correct legal response is you go to the FBI and say, somebody sent this information, true or untrue, and the FBI is not supposed to reveal it to the public. That's what the extortionist is trying to do. The FBI is supposed to protect the privacy and try to capture the extortionist. But to release the information to the public that in all likelihood is not true and the president-elect is saying is not true, but really the crime here is somebody released this private scurrilous information that is in all likelihood not true, but there has been a crime committed. The crime is in releasing private information. What this does is it tells public figures, well, you probably shouldn't go to the FBI because then this private information is going to be made public. So it actually makes uh, lawgivers and public figures, it makes them more susceptible to blackmail if they can't trust the intelligence agencies to actually try to catch the blackmailer, not reveal the blackmail.